Hey man, Chaos Shatty's back with another vlog. Right now I'm in my car. I'm headed over to, um, I think it's called May Maynard High School. It's actually, I think it's the same school that uh, YF and Lucci grew up in. Well, I'm headed over here now because I got to do, I got to cover an event at the at a pet rally. They said Lucci going to be performing at uh, my little partner that I'm shooting for. Um, I, I talked about the 12 videos that I'm doing for him in my last vlog. Um, his name is uh, ASF Fat Man. So I'm going over here. We're gonna shoot some stuff um, for this Pat Riley. Just cover this event, make everything look bigger than life. Get some pictures for his Instagram, you know. So I'm gonna be vlogging that. If you just new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button right now. Oh shit, fucking traffic behind me. <laughs> Talking to y'all. But yeah, hit that subscribe button right now. Also, leave me a like. Big thumbs up. You dig what I'm saying? We super lit on these vlogs. Um, you know, I'm just pumping out consistent content for y'all. Um, I've been back from San Diego for about three days now. Um, straight work. Straight work. I, I linked up with uh, Nebuchadnezzar yesterday. Me and him went to the studio with Nard and B. Um, knocked out like three beats. Um, he working with them real heavy now. I like playing the A and R aspect of the game. You know, I've been A and R records for like six years now. Um, it's one of the passions of mine that I like to do. I'm also thinking about getting back into music. If you scroll back into my videos, you'll see my music videos. It was always different, creative. I just like to create whatever I can do to get my my thoughts out there. I want to do so. Definitely getting back into music soon. But yeah, man, as far as this photography, man, still going strong with it. Um, I talked to Money Man. We trying to get me back on the road as soon as I get all this, this legal stuff out the way. Hopefully I can get back on the road with him. Um, I can't wait. Also, I've been in talks with TK. TK Kravitz, that's another one of my boys. Um, his management want me on the road bad, so. It's all about building your brand. Once you build your brand, you can stand on that, like, None of, the, none of this stuff matter, like trolling on the internet, fucking all these pictures and everything. If you're not putting all your energy on social media towards the bigger picture, which is building your brand, like you're doing everything off for nothing. Like it's all about building your brand because no matter what happens, like anything that happens in life, when you have that brand to stand on and connect with and you have people that's out there looking for your content, and you actually monetize your content, like it's always gonna be there. You ain't really gotta struggle or look for anything. Like this is your life, this is your career. Like more people need to start treating this stuff like a career instead of like treat it as like a, a daytime job or something like that. You think I'm saying? Like make sure you build in your brand, folks. Like I don't care what it is. If you're a painter, make sure you're putting something towards painting. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah. Staying positive too at the same time. Like, just get up, grind hard, and just go at it. You dig what I'm saying? Um, but that's my that's my little motivational speech for the day. We're gonna head over here to this little high school. I ain't been in the high school in years. I know this is gonna be a crazy event, man. I just like, man, just motivating the kids and doing something for the kids. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even gonna. Um, I'm just, I'm just trying to like. I want to see my little homie win. He's 15. He got hard music, and I know, like, when I believe in something, I know it's gonna go. Like, when I was with Money Man, like, before Money Man was Money Man, I knew that he was gonna be big. Like, before Rich Homie Kwan was Rich Homie Kwan, and if Rich Homie Kwan see this, Kwan, if you see this. You already know I told you before you blew up that you was gonna be big. I be I be foreseeing this, man. I, I got the vision. When I hear the music and I see the artists, I know they gonna be, man. And I ain't been wrong. Like everybody that I said I believed in, they they went out there and did something great. They great right now. Like they on the way to being legendary status. <laughs>
What's up, man? I see you out here working. <laughs> that time, man. That shit feel good, don't it?